Good morning all. I'm Dr. Snehal Marik and I'm presenting my uh, work on clinical and epidemiological profile of ocular trauma in tertiary uh, hospital of Central India. Simple yet important topic. Ocular trauma is a significant public health problem, particularly in developing country like India. Uh, it, is, uh, 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 it is important cause of monocular visual impairment and blindness. The late, uh, late presentation may lead to increased morbidity and complication rates. The epidemiology of uh, ocular trauma varies from place to place, which in turn depends upon the workplace, uh, workplace uh, traffic states of that area. So health education safety strategy should be addressed separately for each region. Thus, we aim to highlight clinical profile risk factors and prevalence of ocular trauma in patients uh, attending to OPERI of Uchan Charitable Trust Hospital, a tertiary hospital of central India. This is a prospective observational hospital-based study done for a period of one year. Uh, after taking uh, uh, permission from ethical committee, uh, we've selected a cohort of 156 patients. Uh, a written informed consent was taken, detailed history was taken, thorough ophthalmological examination and radiological investigation was done, and data was analyzed. Coming to the result, out of total patients, uh, uh, 156 patients were obtained, so the prevalence rate was 5.8%. Most of the patient was male, uh, so the uh, predominant patients were male, uh, accounting for 84.6 percent. Most of the patients were from rural region, accounting for 93 uh, out of 153 patients. The age pattern, uh, the most common age group was 16 to 45 years uh, of age, accounting for 80 percent of ages. The most common mode of ocular trauma was agricultural, followed by industrial and road traffic accident. Uh, in our finding, we found uh, the lid involvement and conjunctival involvement were seen in almost all patients, but co uh, corneal abrasions, corneal sclera tears, foreign body over, hyph uh, over cornea, hyphema, and iris prolapse were the most common findings observed. These are the pa few patients. Uh, out of 156 patients, 126, uh, 126 patients required surgical intervention, while others were treated medically. Coming to the discussion part, our study shows a prevalence rate of 5.8%, which is in accordance with Arvind Comprehensive Eye studies, while other studies like Andhra Pradesh study shows higher and Rajendra Prasad Maurya study shows lower incidence. This is an established fact that male has more incidence than female and uh, which uh, this study corroborates the same. The most common age group is being 16 to 45 years. Uh, this is the young active working age group, which drives the economy of the society and our study consistent with Charlie's and Dharma, while uh, a, a study done by LM Kedi shows pre uh, pediatric prevalence. So the most common cause observed was agricultural. Uh, this pattern may be because most of the patients from our places were from rural region, while uh, Guli and others found that uh, the most common uh, cause was road traffic accident, and Rajendra Prasad Maurya found work and home has been most common cause. Uh, in our study, most common cause, were, uh, most common findings were, uh, were lead radiation, corneal abrasions, foreign body over cornea and iris prolapse and hyphema, and cornea was the most commonly found uh, structure, which is consistent with other studies as well. We have uh, 126 patients who required minor or major surgical interventions, but uh, Kinder et al. shows 51% uh, pa 53 patients. Uh, uh, percent patient showed ocular surgery, while Maurya et al. found most of the patient required medical treatment. Uh, coming to the limitations, uh, we found that our uh, to study the epidemiology of this particular uh, ocular trauma, the sample size should be more. Uh, since we have considered only physical ocular injuries, uh, chemical ocular injuries are not involved in this uh, study. So concluding, Males are uh, more predominant. Uh, most of the population were rural based. Uh, the most common cause was agricultural. After eyelid involvement, cornea was the most common cause. So, uh, a coming, uh, so as a good visual equity is associated with early intervention, emphasis must be given on public awareness, health education, and strict legislation to use protect, uh, personal protective measures like goggles during work to reduce the ocular, uh, occurrence of ocular trauma. These are the references. Thank you. Sir, Samantha, sir, any? Yes. So, how would this clot in your region? Sir, the the sir, they were male, uh, male predominance were there. Uh, Injury of the particular portion of the eye. Sir, 
So cornea. Cornea was the most commonest injury. We've observed. How much of them were blind So blind, uh, one, one patient was there, sir. Mm -hmm. Among 156 patients. 156? One, one patient was blind. Yes, sir. How about the blindness? Sir, he had a retinal detachment, sir. Yes, sir, no. actually it was an, uh, oh, so no this is, uh, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir. Since it was a uh, one-year period of time, we didn't found it, though we found it, uh, we've observed it, in but in our study. Among 156, yes, sir. only one patient went blind due to retinal detachment. Yes, sir. Uh, yes, sir. That was due or that was an old... Uh, that was old No, 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 sir, no, sir, no, sir, no, sir, we have not observed a single patient. And, and uh, 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 not working, sir, uh, few patients with corneal opacities or few patients with uh, uh, dislocated no, sir, lens. No, no, sir. They were not blind. They had PL positive or uh, finger counting vision. Then question arises, what is the definition of blindness? Uh, yes, Do you sir. think uh, it is? Window say, is there only PL is there? Is sir, uh, what is social blindness? Social blindness is less than, yes, sir. Social yes, sir. They, uh, now, clinically, they were not, but social blindness, yes, definitely they were social blindness. So how much percentage of them were socially blind? Uh, yes, yes, sir. sir. I'll definitely take care of sir. I, uh, so you must know. Yes, sir. You must know. Yes, there are three types of blindness. One social. medical blindness, one social blindness, social. one medical legal blindness. Yes, sir. So in our day to day life, we have to know how much percentage of the people are socially blind. Socially blind. Yes, sir. So definitely I'll take care of it. Yes, sir. I'll definitely take care of it, please, sir. Yes, sir, it is three by sixty, so, uh, so, so I was talking about medical. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.